Hi guys, good morning. It is Monday. It has to be about 12. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I'm actually going to show you guys some things that I've been doing around my place. Um, if you watched my last vlog, I'll card it at the top. You'll see that um, I did get this little picture, little hangy thingy. So I'm going to show you guys where I ended up putting that and just the change that I made to like my bathroom. So let's go. So instead of it being over the table here, I just moved it to over here, which I think is nicer because it's a smaller wall. So it's just cute. It's just chilling. You know, um, I actually have a different idea for what I'm going to do with over the table. Um, so then at my old place, I had this little mirror hanging on the wall. I think I got it from like five and below. And I just decided to use it um, just on the table because I was like, I don't really know a place I would want to put it. Now, it doesn't really match because it's the white. Like, I would prefer it to be black, but it's cool for now. Um, I just didn't want to, like, just throw it away. So, it's cute. Like a little tray type of vibe. <laughs> so, I had this little thing I got from Five and Below. Um, I actually had this hanging on my bedroom wall. And I had this on it and, like, these two little, like, fake planter. They look like succulents. And I kind of just had them dangling on here. I might put them back to see if I like it. But as of right now, this is just kind of going to go in here because I'm kind of doing like this. This doesn't go here. Like this goldish theme in my bathroom and not in my living room. Okay, so it's the 29th. Look at my nails. It's the 29th. I'm at 149. 1,000 required. 4,000 public watch hours required. I'm at 635. So let's see. Um, my next vlog is going up shortly. I marked it for 430, so hopefully it'll be up by then. It's about 10 o'clock um as you can see my hair looks crazy i just put it in these two buns because i washed it and um i put in a leave-in conditioner so i'm all moisturized up um as you can see the body butter that i use um it's actually a friend of my friends um it's silken skin <laughs> um but it's a really nice brand as you can see i look nice it's smooth child it's not one of those butters that just sit on your skin it kind of like absorbs so in the morning when i wake up i'd be like oh i'd be like yeah so <laughs> um so i wanted to show you guys a couple things that i just purchased after work um starting with i had to i had to re-up on the wine okay and this is the 19 crimes um this is a favorite of mine this is actually a favorite of mine um i plan on doing a i plan on doing a like june favorites um i'm really gonna film that at the end of this week but um you guys will see this first, but I'm going to probably do my June favorites so that I can mention this because this has like really been a favorite of mine. Um, they have a couple other brands, a couple other um, alcohol percentages. This is a 14.1. So this one is a little bit more on the drunker side, child, if you will. Um, so, the, oh, oh, oh. I, <laughs> I went to the, the, when I was at the liquor store, I was actually getting a red wine and I was getting a white wine, right? The guy at the register is like, oh, this is a $50 wine. Do, 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 do. It comes in a box. It's two in here. He said, I'll give it to you for 20 Unprovoked, child. I ain't even asked for that. I was like, but the other, the white wine that I was getting, um, it was about 30 So he said, give me, he'll give me these two for 20 So I was like, let me see, child. He's like, well, yeah, this is a, this is a good brand. This is, you know, expensive, like good wines. I was like... All right, let me see because basically it would be two wines for twenty dollars which is each for ten so i was like all right ten dollar wine like whatever um but i'm actually gonna look at my computer really fast i'm gonna see if he was lying let's see if he was lying let's see if he finessed me so this is like bola it says bola fondara fondara bola okay let me see so fondala you know what <laughs> let me just take it out I'm like what am i doing all right so 
it's a white wine in here this is a pinot grigio it's funny because the other one that i had picked up was also a pinot grigio so i guess it kind of worked out and then this one i don't know how to pronounce that but uh, let me just google it so this says bola oh i put bada girl it's giving slow <laughs> now just finesse me i'm screaming you know what forget those people girl why does say can y'all see that <laughs> i was just saying y'all see that <laughs> yo i'm really i'm really done that's the last time they <laughs> yo i should have known he was lying like i'm screaming uh, i should have known he was lying anyway <laughs> shout out to my wines <laughs> that i paid 20 dollars for you know what i should have oh morgan anyway that's cool i'm still going to enjoy my wine i'm trying to find the percentage of it this is a 12.5 so i guess like whatever child this is a 13 percent. so okay they high in percentage but he lied he's like yeah like they come in their box <laughs> i said hmm so gullible i'm screaming but anyway, what's the next thing? So, um, I also stopped at Target to pick up more, um, my Pianoxyl face wash. This is about $10. This is the one that I pretty much use for my skin. Um, you know, my skin is, is struggling. Well, it's gotten better. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I don't have crazy breakouts. Like, my skin is flat for the most part. Like, it's not like it's super bumpy. It's just my blemishes and my discoloration that I'm just trying to get rid of right now. Um... So I have this. So then I picked this up. This is a benzoyl peroxide actual gel. And this is an acne medication that I got from Kyra I'm Unique. She put this in her, I think it might've been a vlog that she was putting it on or something. I'm not even sure, but I wanna kind of use this like in a spot type of treatment way. Um, and yeah, so um, hopefully this will work. I'll use this together. And then, I had to get some of my pixie um, toner and what's funny is that this is 27 on amazon and it was 29 at target now mind you of course after you pay shipping hand you end up paying more at, tar at amazon than you would target so i was just like whatever and i couldn't find it and this was in the section with the it said like follow the trend or something like girl this is what i use or oh, like a trend anyway but i guess maybe like it is kind of blowing up now like maybe an influencer m mentioned it which is probably why a lot of people are trying to purchase it i'm not really sure but this is what i like to use and then i picked up some command strips which are 80 dollars come here child command <laughs> command strips be so expensive child like hmm? but yes yeah, so i'm going to show you guys what i'm going to be using the command strips for hopefully they work it say 12 pounds but you know they be lying but on to the next. Make sure my address is not in it. Um, so, I one, two, three. Okay. Um, so I got these. These are picture frames, and I got this idea from um, I think her name is High Low Lux. I'm gonna put her at here, be, or not her at, but it's her YouTube, and she does like she did this girl her house tour was so her house tour was everything so um she actually had this idea on her wall she put like these picture frames i think she had nine of them so it was like one two three one two three one two three and they all had different pictures in them and i'm like that's such a cute idea um i've really been trying to get into decorating my space like it's pretty basic for right now but i am going to be incorporating some nicer pieces it's something that i want to put here um so uh, as time goes on you guys will see me kind of decorate and i kind of enjoy the process um my last place i didn't do much um and i think a mixture of that was because i had a roommate so it's like of course everything we do we kind of split you know and i didn't want to keep hey like you got half of the money for this i'm trying to decorate like you know what i'm saying so now that i'm now that i'm here by myself i'm only responsible it's only my money so why are my hands just moving but <laughs> uh now that i'm just here by myself it's like i'm going to try to use this to cut Oh, that wouldn't work my keys right here but anyway now that i'm by myself um i'm just gonna be like okay let me try to make my apartment cute 
So I kind of took this idea from High Low Lux. I really keep saying that. I don't know if that's her ad or not, but you guys will see what it is when I actually upload it, upload this video. So the pack that I got from Amazon, this comes in seven. So I'm probably just gonna do six. My ball's not that big, so I don't need like a whole wall full of photos. But um, I'm actually gonna show you guys me decorating this. I plan on doing like a clean with me video. I'm just kind of straightening up my apartment, um, especially after I do my laundry, as you can see. <laughs> my laundry is full. So I'm gonna do a clean with me and kind of incorporate this into the clean with me because I'm gonna be adding the pictures into the frames, hanging on the wall, you know, just kind of like doing everything at one time. And I'm not gonna show you guys the same footage over again. Okay, so they just look like this. So I'm just gonna kind of, let me just get another one. I don't know who family this is, but. It's like now, nah, but I'm just gonna hang them like do 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 like one two three one two three. Um, this is a pack of seven. I'll link these below. I know. Um, I guess it depends on if you guys are interested in this type of home decor stuff. Probably not because it's just like I'm just <laughs> doing my little homes, my little apartment stuff. But I'll still link them below just in case anyone's interested. And um, I actually got some pictures printed. Um, so. I'm gonna show you, I will show you guys that. I'm gonna show you guys the pictures that I printed. And I got these in an eight by 10 because they're gonna fit in the frame. They're gonna fit in the frame so well. It's me! <laughs> it's me! So I just went to Walgreens and got these printed and I'm actually just gonna do like one, two, three, one, two, three. Now granted, everything is not me. Everything is not pictures of me, um, but some are. So some pictures are just, I actually just took this picture over the weekend, but all these pictures that I'm printing are pictures that I've taken. So I was just like, you know what? I like taking pictures sometimes. So let me just get them printed. <laughs> um, this is a Seriaco bag that I actually took this picture. <laughs> this is a Seriaco, like I said, a Seriaco bag. I love this brand. This is a black owned business. Bags, cute, okay? My bag over there, you can probably see a little bit. It's back there um but just just random pictures so i can't wait to show you guys how this turns out this is my lip gloss a picture that i've taken once again this is um the vision workshop i'm gonna put my ad here get y'all some gloss shameless plug um so that's that what other pictures did i anyway what other pictures did i do oh i did this picture so it'll look cute in the frame i tried to center it a little bit it's kind of off as you can see like this one this side it's like slightly bigger than that side. I tried to center it a little bit, but yeah, that's one picture I got. Then I did this picture. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> I feel so like, con not conceited, but like narcissistic. Just all pictures of me. <laughs> There's all pictures of me. Um, I actually am going to be trying to take some pictures with other people. I do have pictures of me and my sister. I have pictures of me and my best friend. Um, I don't have a whole lot of family pictures, so I didn't want to put some people on my wall and then other people not on my wall. You know, it's just it's like, I might as well just kind of like do me and then add pictures in that I feel are not aesthetically pleasing, but kind of aesthetically pleasing. You know? So I'm going to show you guys how I do that. Oh, it's going to be so cute. Okay. I got a um, wick trimmer. Um, I don't know if you guys saw me light my candle, but it kind of had that like ball at the top. And you know, they say you're supposed to trim that, um, you're supposed to trim that part of it so that it doesn't, it burns a little bit smoother. And it doesn't, it don't be all over the place. You know, the flame be all high. <laughs> so you're supposed to trim your wick and whatnot. I don't have a pair of scissors, um, but when I open them, I'll put them on the screen somewhere. But that was the only other thing that I got. Ouch. Um, and I've just been ordering some things here and there. Like I said, I do have something I'm going to put here. Um, just, you'll see. You'll see. Hey guys, it is Thursday. Happy July 1st. Um, I'm just doing some things. Doing some errands. Running around a little, little bit. Um, I actually just completed this training for the incident that happened in my job. As I'm leaving, the lady going to say, oh, it would have been better to have this before. I was like, yeah. So basically, we had to do the training twice. We had to do it virtually, and then we had to go in person to do the same training. And I was just like, okay. Um, 
but now that that's over i can continue on with the rest of my day hey guys i'm finally in this spot again like <laughs> i feel like my vlogs lately i've been kind of like on the go i haven't been sitting here because i haven't had the morning really to sit and talk so it is <clears throat> so it is what's today it's thursday it's the first actually happy july um i do have some things planned for the month of july as far as my videos go and i was like writing them all down i'm not going to show you my handwriting because i look i write like a little boy a little <laughs> i write like a little boy okay but um as a matter of fact i'll show you guys so I made like a cute little list here. Not a cute list, child, but you know what I'm saying. Like, um, I want to do June favorites. Um, just things from around my house that I, excuse me, that I've enjoyed using for the month of for the month of June. I got this idea from Kirsten Ashley. I'll kind of explain a little bit more about it once I actually do the video. But I want to do a clean with me, um, especially when I get like the picture frames and stuff, so I can kind of like set that up for you guys. It'll be really cute. <clears throat> And uh, sorry, y'all, I just ate, so I'm like clearing my throat. Um, I have some other things, you know, I wanted to do a clothing haul. Um, so yeah, I'm kind of mapping July out now. I actually started mapping August out too, but that's a different story. Um, so uh, my friend had a baby shower that I missed because I had to work. So um, I just told her that I would come during the week so that I could drop off her gift. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got. These are things from her registry, so I mean, you guys probably don't care about this type of stuff, but I'm gonna show you guys anyway, just to kind of um, tell you guys what I'm up to. So I just bought her this little baby bath thingy. These are all things from her registry. So um, I wasn't random with it. She wanted these, um, this baby moisturizing set by the brand Honest. So um, that was on her list. I made sure I got that. Um, she wanted these little parade animal links, I guess for when um baby girl gets a little bigger because she's having a girl so she wanted those i got her of course a card um i got this little confetti stuff just to kind of put throughout the little bag that i bought which is this kind of big pink bag i bought her some pampers um yeah that was the last thing i bought her a box of pampers but i kept it in my car because it was no sense in bringing it in the house so i bought a lamp I bought a lamp. <laughs> I bought a lamp. So I'm probably gonna put it over here. It's like black and it said metal, it said a metal finish. But I couldn't really tell based on the box. Like I was looking at the box like, is that silver? Um, but I think it's black and silver. So I'm really excited about that because I've been trying to like my lighting over here is poor. It sucks. So I'm all crazy looking. So my air just kicked on, of course. Hating. But anyway. I bought, also I bought this Cara bag. Oh, wait. I bought this Cara bag. And at first, well, let me just explain this really quickly because I actually recorded this footage already the other day. You guys probably noticed that there wasn't like a, what was it? Tuesday? It wasn't like a Monday or a Tuesday in there because I recorded it already, but I hated the footage. Terrible, I looked a mess. Now granted, I still kind of look a mess, but I looked worse than this. I was like, oh, I'm gonna cancel that footage out. <laughs> and show you guys in a like a better setting so um this is Kara, my Kara bag she's so cute <gasps> look at this chain you see how thick and heavy and sturdy this chain is so <laughs> so um this is cute now this is the bike wallet this is the um the larger bike wallet they have a mini bike wallet which is what really caught my eye at first it's like half the size of this but it still has the big bulky chain that is just so cute and um, it kind of looks weird in a way because the chain is so big and then it's just attached to this little baby like wallet size. Um, but they're more expensive because that's like their highlight piece of their brand. Like these big bike chain wallets, that's what people are driven to. So I got the bigger one. It kind of matches my aesthetic, this silver brown look, love it. Can't wait to wear this with something. Um, and this is honestly my first kind of like luxury purchase as far as like bags go. Um, and I was excited about that because I typically do like, you know, I get them Shein, I buy a little Shein bag or, you know, I haven't bought a little bag in a minute, but that's what I would do uh, traditionally or typically, that's what I would do. Um, so I was like, you know what? 
Um, and I do want to say that like luxury is definitely based on what you what you feel like is luxury. Because at first I was like, is this really luxury? Like y'all probably don't even know the brand. Like y'all probably don't even know. Um, but I still feel like it was luxury because it's something that I kind of had to put more money into. Something that I I was looking at for a while. I actually wanted this on my birthday, which is last year. So it just was like I've been kind of had my eye on it. And I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna get it. So. I was excited about this. I'll link this below, um, just in case you guys are interested in the brand. Like I said, their bike wallets are the staple. Like, they actually look cute. Like, they just look really cute. So I'll link this bag below if anyone wants to check out Cara, 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 whatever you want to call it, <laughs> below. Um, so yeah. But aside from that, I have like um, tomorrow. I'm supposed to be getting my hair done tomorrow. Um, my hair breaks off so terribly in the back, like, I can never understand why. Um, my stylist always asks me, like, well, are you pinning your hair back too much? But, like, <laughs> I've had this issue for years, too. Like, there was one point in time where I did, I, I did a, um, shortcut because my hair was breaking off. Um, yeah, so, I'm kind of over it. I don't know what's wrong with my hair, y'all. But, you know, um, I just, I don't know. I'm gonna get my hair done tomorrow and then see you guys will see what it'll end up what I ended up doing with it. So I'm about to put this stuff in the bag so I can um, take this to her and then I can fin finish with the rest of my day. So yeah, you guys can watch me. <laughs> hey guys, um, I never took my took the gift to my friend. It's actually sitting right there. I got really lazy. I actually took a nap and I was just like, no. Um, but what I will do in a moment, I'm just going to set up the lamp. I haven't figured out where I want to put it, but I want to set it up first so that I can kind of get a visual. Um, I do have a lamp already, as you guys can see. This one here, I've actually had for years. It's my dad's old lamp. So I'm going to see where I can kind of place it. It's like a cream color um silver base as you can see and the other one i have is like a silver and black so i'm gonna show you guys me putting it together and i guess trying to figure out where i want to, where i wanted to go so let me get my behind up because if i don't then i'm gonna fall back to sleep and that's not what i want because i have an appointment in the morning um so and i'm contemplating on if i want to make a little drinky drink or if i want to actually just pour a glass of wine I may just do the wine just because it's a little simpler and maybe I'll make a drinky drink like like a cocktail type of thing later for like dinner dinner like when I eat later I've been wanting some <laughs> clearly um but I'll definitely show you guys whatever I ended up making so so I told you guys the other day I recorded um some footage and I looked crazy so I deleted it that same day I made a drink that I wanted to show you guys <laughs> the drink that I made I just use like cherries and stuff. I made a TikTok out of it. So I'm going to put the TikTok on the side here. It actually did pretty well on TikTok. Low key. Like I got like 30,000 views it was. Um, I don't know TikTok's al algorithm just yet. Like I'm trying to figure out how sometimes some do good and some don't. <laughs> I don't know yet. I think it's based off like hashtags and stuff. But um, yeah. So I made that drink. I really wanted to show you guys. So I wanted to kind of not re-record that moment. But just kind of tell you guys I made a drink so you guys can actually see what I mean. So. sturdy and heavy though i didn't expect it to be this color i thought it was going to be darker or lighter i thought it was gonna be more of a silver it's kind of like like a dark gold so um 
I think it still does fit the space, like this black sleek look. I, I still do like it. Um, let me get a light bulb. So I have a day bulb here that I'm gonna be screwing in in a moment. I didn't plug it in or anything. I'm gonna put the light bulb in first, of course. But it's really sexy though, look at it, it's super cute. I might have to go back and get a second one so I can have two. Balance, you know, some little balance. Yeah, like, what? <laughs> Y'all, it looks so stupid. <laughs> it looks so dumb. Oh my God, I gotta figure it out. Okay, so I did get it. <laughs> so you have to, I know it's dark in here, but I'm about to turn it on. But you have to unscrew this light and just kind of like shift it, so. Oh, oh wow. That's, whoa, that's very bright. Um, That was real bright. Do I like that? Oh. I don't know, y'all. Do I like this? Maybe I need to get a different bulb. That's probably what it is. It's just too bing, bing, bow, bright. Um, yeah, it's definitely that day bulb that's making it super bright. So maybe just something more calming. Like, good morning vlog. It's Friday. It's raining. I'm actually headed to my hair, hair appointment. I swear, every time I have a hair appointment, it's raining. Like, it just never, it never fails. I can never just leave out the shop and get in my car. Um, so I do have a scarf here with me so that I can put it over my head when I leave. Um, of course, I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. I'm not gonna get it dyed. I decided just not to. I honestly just didn't feel like spending the money, like if we're being completely honest. Like, I was like, I already need a trim. So I'm just like, I'm just gonna just get it done next time. <laughs> get the color done next time. <clears throat> Hopefully it doesn't look a mess, but we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Um, but yeah, I'll tune back in when I'm at the salon. So I was really barely able to record. I really hate first day hair, like it sucks. <laughs> um, but I got it curl only because um, it lasts longer to straight for me. Like, I always pin curl my hair pretty much every night. So, the curls just stay. When I have it straight, it start looking a mess. Like, way faster than uh, it does when I get curls. So, I just got it curled, whatever. As you can see, I didn't get it dyed. Like I said, I just was kind of... Let it grow out. Um, she said I had a lot of breakage, of course, which I knew. Um, so, uh. um, I actually think I like the way the color looks. Since it's not at the root, it kind of looks like highlights a little bit. As you can see, my hair is dropping. <laughs> but um, I'm just going to end up wrapping it. I kind of like it a little bit. Just, just a little bit. But on a better, on a crazier note, I ended up picking up some cleaning, carpet cleaning stuff. I don't think it's going to work. But I picked up this. Stains gone guarantee, child. We going to see because, <laughs> you know, they be lying. Um, and then I picked up some OxyClean. So I'm going to try. It's literally, it literally happened 12 hours ago at this point. So, um, don't know how well it's going to do, but if you guys have any suggestions for stain removals for like wine specifically, please let your girl know because carpet so rugs are not cheap. I don't know if you guys ever bought like a rug. What was the dim I don't even remember the dimensions for this, but like eight by 10, I think I have. I don't know, but either way, rugs are not cheap, okay? I looked up on Google, they said I should boil some hot water, let the hot water kind of <laughs> do its job, I suppose, and then kind of start applying the stuff that I uh, the stuff that I bought. So I'm gonna give that a try and I will check in with you guys later. No, but I think I want to film my uh, monthly favorites. I'm gonna do my June favorites. I wanted to have it up early July, so it's the second now so um i'm gonna try to film that today the lighting in here isn't that bad it's not that sunny out um my hair is done so now i don't feel like <laughs> on a camera um i may do a little bit to my face just to kind of make the video a little bit cute um so yeah i hope you guys like that i think it'll be kind of cute kind of fun showing you guys the things around my place i like so yeah <laughs> so you guys are gonna think that i'm crazy but it's okay I know y'all saw these leggings before. <laughs> um, but I'm sacrificing this lovely pillow 
for the greater good okay so i told you guys i spilled wine on my carpet the wine also spilled on the pillow but as you can see well you can see the stain a little bit but but look at it as a matter of fact i'm gonna flip it to the side so i'm just gonna show y'all because clearly i got got it out right clearly you see and you want to know what the lovely trick to it this is out it says stains going guarantee i say okay i'm gonna test that so <laughs> i'm like literally crazy for this okay this is red wine and what i'm gonna ah! and what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna pour <laughs> y'all like wait i'm gonna pour the wine on the pillow and then I'm gonna get it out with the zout. Okay, we're gonna get it out with the zout. Can y'all see? Okay. <gasps> okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Wine on the pillow. Y'all see it. Now, mind you, the stain happened yesterday. Um, yesterday, maybe like 11 p.m. So by the time I actually got to get to this pillow, it had been tw over 12 hours since it had been sitting in the pillow. So I'm just gonna show y'all this real quick. So let's get this baby out. <laughs> but I was so hyped because I was like, oh my gosh, it works. Now, granted, I don't know how well it's going to work on carpet, but, you know, so I, then I just took this little scrubber. You see, it's already coming out. Oh my gosh, can y'all see that? So, let's give it a little scrubby scrub. She see money all around me. I look like I'm the man. But I was done on the last week Tell me where have you been? Yeah, came out of yeah. Now, it is not absolutely perfect as you can see it still has a little bit of coloring to it But the pillow had a nice big stain like right here Well, I think it was on this side And not too shabby Now granted you can wash this I'm probably gonna end up still throwing it in a washer Just to get all of the zout chemicals out <laughs> um and it might be might be fine we might be able to work with this now granted um you can just buy another pillow but i just wanted to show you guys why i was just so excited i said oh it came out but i'm just not sure how it'll how well it'll work for my carpet i have you guys behind my bed as you can see it got on here so before i change my sheets i was gonna try and give it a little scrapey scrub but as you can see it's like not really it's not really doing much um i do have some oxyclean right here as well which i've never used before i've been trying to read the directions but i'm just gonna have to just ugh. anyway um let me tilt you guys down all right so this is where this thing is uh, as you can see it's so ugly um like what the hell like anyway so i do have some hot water because i did see i did see on google somebody said boil some water and girl ugh, i know i'm not doing this right I, I just feel it in my soul ah no all right somebody said just put some hot water on it to kind of lift the color all right okay it did lift okay 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 wait there so now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna spray the spray the zout spray the zout hopefully it get on out child <laughs> like oh guys look can you see that it is kind of working oh god like this stuff is everywhere i hate I hate this you guys see okay not too bad i'm not mad at it at all right now let me see um i do have some more hot water on the stove so i can 
get some more. Luckily, like this is in the back of my bed, so you clearly can't see. It's not like it's a huge stain where everyone can see. But just the fact that it's even here is just annoying me, you know? But it kind of worked. It's working. So if you got stains, y'all, get some zelt. Not sponsored content. <laughs> I didn't need to use the OxyClean. I may still use it. Let me see. Um, I think the directions said you gotta let it like sit or something. I don't know. Let me just see. I'm clearly just trying stuff, y'all. Clearly. I tried a different method for the bed. I'm just clearly gonna wash it and then hope that you see the OxyClean changed it blue. But yeah, so I'm gonna do that with that. But you see the carpet. It's so, you know, still wet, of course, from the hot water, but I ain't mad at it. I know y'all saw it in the beginning. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm really happy about that. Well, I just did the math because I would my goal is to have a thousand subscribers by October. So I'm at 169. So in order to get to a thousand by the end of October, that's four months from now, that'll be about two hundred and seven subscribers each month. I think I can do it. Let me know what videos you guys want to see because I do have some planned. Um, like I was saying, I do have kind of like my structure of what I'm going to be doing for July. But if you guys think of something, then of course I'll be willing to incorporate that throughout the summer. Maybe I can try it in August or maybe I can switch something out and do something else this month instead of something that I've already had planned. So let me know what you guys think. Um, the next video I'm going to do is going to be my June favorites. So you guys will probably see that shortly. It's so gloomy here today. I really wanted to film it today, but it's just so gloomy. Like, the lighting is just not giving. Um, so, I'll figure that out. You know what? Bye. Not me talking in the bra. Just sitting here. Like, Morgan. I don't feel like recording it over again. <laughs> uh, hmm. <laughs> Like I was saying before, I was really interrupted. I'm probably going to try to aim for 1,000 by October. So cross my fingers. Let's get it, guys. Um, Thank you guys all for being here. Um, I do appreciate every subscriber. Like, I'm trying not to count i'm trying not to st i'm trying not to pay attention to the numbers i really am but it's just so it makes me so happy every time i get one more you know but yeah so see y'all in whatever i'm doing next it'll probably be well tyra's on her way actually so you guys will probably see her i'm gonna make her a drink so i'll probably show you guys what i end up making her um i usually just do like a rum well i have like the strawberry rum and i just be like putting cherries in it and then i just <laughs> And then I just do it like that. So it's nothing, nothing special. Um, oh, the TikTok I posted, that's at 44,000 views. Ah, people like it. Okay, cool. Well, just because people viewing it don't mean they like it. But <laughs> no, I don't. A quedgy, mm -hmm. a coochie wedgie. <laughs> you know what? Cyrus here, guys. <laughs> Okay, so here's our footage. She's putting on her computer. Click uh, on that or we know, something like that. Okay, clarity. I'm crying. <laughs> With the cat more. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Welcome to my best friend's YouTube channel. It's not even playing. Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> All right, wait. Let me take my scarf off. It's literally so short. Oh, my gosh. You gotta be cut it. It's okay. Oh, it won't tuck behind my ear. Oh my, okay, whatever. Okay. Package, what did I get? Let me see, because I really don't know. This is Tyra, guys. Hi. Tyra, aka Trilla, period. You know, you know what? I'm going to tag my my previous video, the photo shoot video, because this was... <laughs> All right, so what did I even get? No, seriously. No, but wait, what is this? <laughs> yeah, yo. <laughs> Keep saying it. We're good. You know what? Wait, let me don't say it. It's a vase, but look how. <laughs> Why would they play me like that?
like smaller than the size of my head. You in your room. That's what you got. Click this one. You in your room. <laughs> yeah, like literally. Now, I have a. Why is it so big? You know what? I'm really done with everything. <laughs> what is this? It's supposed What's to be smaller for my chairs. I wanted to put it, drape it over my chair, but it's so big. Is it too big? Let me think. I wanted to drape it over, but it's kind of wide. Oh my God, Morgan. What the hell? <laughs> it's not giving. It's not. It's not, it's not giving. I would Wait. say maybe like, can you thumbtack it? Would that defeat the purpose of the wood look? Yeah. A little bit. <laughs> Why is it such a horrible Amazon haul? Get like a little out. All right, okay. Let's see about the next box. Yeah, like, I was looking forward to that. I don't even know what I got. Okay, all right. So this is my plan. I wanted to put the pompous grass in the vase. Not the pompous grass. <laughs> <laughs> put the pompous grass. <laughs> put, put the pompous grass in the vase. <laughs> Saturday morning and I'm currently trying to get ready to um well I'm packing for my vending event it's at one um so currently it's about it's going on 10 so I spent the morning my dad came to pick up his father's his late father's gift and I've just been kind of sorting everything um getting all my glosses all my oils all together so that I can be ready to go so at the last vending event, um, I'm actually gonna card it at the top. I did like this um, make your own gloss thing. Super cute, like I really wish I did it again, but I didn't do it this time around um, because I didn't buy all the supplies for it. So I'm just gonna do a regular table this time. I usually like to incorporate something inter interactive at my table. Like I've done little dice games where it's like you have to roll this big dice and whatever it lands on is what you get. Like if you maybe if you make a purchase you get well that's how i did it. if you make a purchase you can roll the dice which then might get you another gift like okay you'll win a one ounce body oil or you'll win two glosses of your choice or three mini glosses because i used to have these like really small glosses and stuff um so i always like to make my table interactive just to kind of get people coming back to kind of get people interested like oh what's this like i always like to do that which i didn't do this time so um my table gonna be a little boring this time around but um i'm still looking to have fun meet other business owners it's always such a good vibe vending events are always like you buying from everybody else that's the main supporters is the other vendors so i'm gonna end up wrapping up shortly and um trying to head out soon because i do want to stop and get um i want to stop and get candy i usually bring this little this little jar it's like a little heart jar and I put like Jolly Ranchers or just something at the table just to kind of get people, oh, like, you know, <laughs> me and this interactive thing. But um, rain was actually on the forecast for today. So we were debating on if we wanted to just take it inside um, or not. So I have to figure out what I'm going to wear. Um, so the next time you guys see me, I will probably be dressed and probably at the event. I don't think I'm going to vlog me going to the store, you know. <laughs> So, um, I will see you guys there. If you do want to check out my other vending event that I did, um, like I said, I carded it at the top. Um, just in case you're interested in stuff like that. I thought it was pretty cute. So, as I'm getting ready, I was just thinking about a little conversation I had with Tyra yesterday about, like, what's one thing you do that you'll probably, that you've been doing since you were younger that you'll always do. And she said, for me, it's probably how I pin curl my hair. And it made me laugh because I was pin curling my hair last night. And I basically just use these little clips. And I don't know if you guys know what it is. But what I do is I just take a little section of hair and I pin curl it. I just do like a little curl. And this, okay, so I'm just showing you guys the finish. So I basically would just put a pin in just like that. And that's how I sleep with my hair. Um, and it's something that I've been doing since a child, okay. Um... I learned when I was really young because I would always get these like little natural styles, get my hair straightened, whatever. Um, but it helps my it helps my curls last. I know you guys know, can tell my hair doesn't look the same as what it looked like yesterday. Um, but I think that it helps my curls last. Like 
um it's probably something that's just gonna carry me to the great child this little um long sleeve dress it's kind of cold outside so i was really looking for something long sleeve as opposed to being short and cold um it's like 70 low less than 70 degrees and i'm like i'm not trying to be cold because i'm beard so um i'm getting ready to go it's already like 11 o'clock now so let me head on out and you guys will see me officially at the event <laughs> I just show you guys my perfume for the day. Um, I'm going to be using the Burberry Her. This is just a favorite. Mm, love it so much. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So, all right, I'm getting ready to go, like, for real, y'all. Seriously. chill for the rest of the day that's kind of like my mood um i really want to wrap my hair up because it's just you know humid and rainy and a uh, child hey guys it is sunday um my hair looks crazy we just gonna rock with it right now <laughs> um but i'm actually trying to edit this video um this is my what is this one called oh my gosh this is my june favorites <laughs> And as I said in the video, like it was inspired by Kirsten Ashley. And I thought it was just the cutest video. I was like, you know what? I'm going to show you guys some of my favorite things throughout the apartment. Hopefully by the time you see this, it's already up and you guys seen it, like it, whatever. Hopefully. And that was my first time using my camera too. I haven't used my camera yet, like officially. So that was my first time kind of filming on my camera. So I thought it came out pretty nice. I thought it looked cute. <laughs> I'm not sure really what I'm going to be doing for the rest of my day um i kind of wanted to it's the fourth of july i was thinking about seeing who was barbecuing you know getting some food i guess but you know that's not really a special holiday so i'm just really need to chill and like i said finish this vlog and then um i'll tune back in with you guys yeah i'm gonna see what i'm doing later <laughs> and then if you guys see me doing something then i'll close the vlog out later hey guys later in the day 
um i just decided to go see my mom so um i'm gonna go say hi to her i think she put some stuff on the grill so i'm just wearing this little one piece <laughs> um this is like the second time i wore it and i tried to do this little like wrap thing so my bra wouldn't show i saw it on like tiktok or something but i can't seem to get it right well the way she did it was different so that's why it's not right but <laughs> um yeah so just gonna chill i'm actually gonna wrap the vlog up here because i'm probably not gonna record much while i'm at my mom's so thank you guys so much for tuning in and i'll see you guys tomorrow